Hey y'all, it's Jason. Welcome back. Today's installment, we're going to be drinking some local beer from my home area of Georgia. That's right, y'all. Stay tuned for another thrilling installment of My Wonderful Adventures in Beer. Hey everybody, welcome back. Hope everybody's enjoying their Labor Day weekend. Nice, long, three-day weekend. And you know what that means? It's time to drink some beer. Well, like I said today, uh, this Georgia boy is drinking local once again. Uh, today we're going to be drinking a beer from the Six Bridges Brewing Company out of Johns Creek, Georgia. Uh, I've actually been to the Johns Creek location and I really like it. Great people, great beer, and I'm really excited because they just opened their new Crab Apple location, uh, which I hope to hit in the next week or so. And, uh, keep you all posted. Maybe I'll do an on-site there. Uh, moving forward though, today's beer is called the Medlock and it is a New England Hazy IPA. And I've had this beer a couple times and I really like it. So I uh, figured I'd share it with y'all. Here's our can art. They always have some really cool artwork. I'd love to meet their artist. Maybe one day that'll happen. And uh, this does clock in at 6.2% and I have no information on the IBUs, unfortunately. Uh, and again, just as a reference, IBUs are the International Bitterness Unit. The higher the IBU, the more the bitter is gonna, the beer is gonna be. So an IPA is normally gonna have a higher IBU than a stout or a lager, or whatnot, because the hops brings out that that bitterness. So let's quit talking technical crap and let's drink some beer. In fact, today I've even got the appropriate Six Bridges glassware. So let's uh, let's crack this bad boy open. Let's pour some beer. Well, I hope everybody is home safe or wherever you are. I hope you are safe this weekend and putting back a few. But remember, don't drink and drive. Call Uber, call Lyft, call your friends. Be safe because I love y'all. So That's a good looking beer. It is nice and hazy. I do like that. It's very pretty. It's got a nice orangish color to it really decent uh, head maintaining look no, actually poured a decent beer for once right it's a good looking beer though on the aroma I'm getting some uh, some grass notes and some uh, citrus peel a hint of the grapefruit but most of just like an orange rind it smells very refreshing so uh, let's quit wasting time y'all and let's put it down Oh, quite tasty. Very, very tasty indeed. It's um, very mild. It's not very bitter at all. So it's going to have a low IBU. Uh, I'm going to have to research that, find out what it is. <clears throat> it's very, very tasty though. I'm definitely picking up the subtle notes of orange. I'm not picking up the grapefruit though. And um, I'm getting some honey in there. And the mouth feels a little bit thick. Um, yes, it, it's a hazy IPA, but it's a little bit thicker mouthfeel than a normal hazy IPA. It's very tasty though. I could easily sit around and drink these all day long. So uh, cheers y'all. Peace out. And remember, every beer is an adventure. It's just waiting for you. Have a beer. <laughs>